good afternoon. I am meteorologist Michelle McCormick, and I just want to give you a really brief update on what's happening in the tropics, because we want to continue to track this for you. This is the 11 o'clock update, and as we get closer to the 5 p.m. update, this is the latest track. So currently, uh, Aaron is a tropical storm moving to the west at 17 miles per hour. It's actually slowed down. Earlier, it was at 20 miles per hour. But, but even over the weekend, this storm is expected to become a Category 2, then a Category 3 storm, which is a major hurricane as it starts to make this turn to the north and hopefully stay well off our coast. Right now, we are keeping a close eye on it. The winds are at 45 miles per hour. Now it becomes a category one storm when winds become 74 and above. So with intensification, definitely comes this, uh, this system. So I also wanted to show you another model run that we have, and it is of the wave tracker. So Aaron's the red mark there moving along. And the maximum sustained winds, of course, are 45, but the storm force winds are extending up to 60 miles right now. One of the biggest things we really need to keep an eye on, and this is where it's really gonna affect our weather, is the rip current risks. Uh, this is when our surf and our rip currents become extremely dangerous. And that's gonna be something that we're gonna be watching very closely for you with now Tropical Storm Aaron, eventually Hurricane Aaron, if it were to continue on this trajectory. But the rip current risks are gonna be a factor in our rising surf will be a factor as well. One thing that we really want to hammer home is preparation. Regardless of where this storm is and where it's going, it's uncertain over the next five to seven days as soon as it's off our coast, but preparation is key. So just make sure you have your batteries and make sure your generators start and make sure you have your water one gallon per person per day. These are just the key things that you need to do to be prepared for any storm, whether it's 600 miles off our, course, our coast or 60 miles off our coast.